Hi, and welcome to First Things First. I'm Tom Eisen, and this is the show where you learn how to build a thriving nonprofit and live inspired. In the next few minutes, I'm going to be talking with you about why it's a terrible mistake for nonprofits to raise money by requiring board members to ask people for money. We've all had that experience, right? You're in some kind of give or get, and the board is forced to ask people for money. It's just ridiculous. Because when a person feels pressured to ask for money, or is afraid to ask, or loathes the task, bad things can happen. Number one, you get no donation. Hey, if a board member is inexperienced and flubs the ask, the donor may say no and walk away. Number two, you get a smaller donation. Again, if a board member is inexperienced, the donor may make a donation, but it may be smaller because the board member was ineffective. Number three, the donor stops giving. Let's say a board member is so bad at asking for money that the donor stops giving altogether because they think the organization is unprofessional. Number four, you get bad press. If a donor has a bad giving experience, there is a strong likelihood they're going to tell their friends about it and the last thing that any nonprofit needs is bad press about its fundraising tactics. Number five, your board member quits. Face it, some board members are so afraid to ask people for money that they'd rather eat soap than ask a friend or a stranger for a donation. If you force people to ask for money, you will lose board members. All right, let's say you're a board member. What does all this mean to you? It means if you're not genuinely excited and passionate about asking people for money, you shouldn't be doing it. Let someone else do it who's good at it. However, if you're interested in asking people for money, but are terrible at it, or nervous about it, or would like to get better at it, you can learn to be an effective solicitor, and it would be my pleasure to help you do that. Now, for you loafers out there, let me just say this. If you're fearful of asking people for money, or lack the skill to do it well, it doesn't let you off the fundraising hook. As a board member, it's your responsibility to support the fundraising efforts of your nonprofit to ensure it can meet its financial obligations. I'll be talking more about this in my next video called Give or Get next week. What's most important to remember from today is never, never, never force someone on your board or staff to ask for money. You not only risk losing donations, you also risk losing donors and board members in the process. That's a lose, lose, lose situation you never want to face. Well, that's it. Thanks again for tuning in. And remember, keep fueling your passion and giving back because the world needs more people like you to make it a better place. Have an outstanding day.